All right, meteorologist Mike Cameron has the weekend off, and so I'm more than happy to bring you the details of today's forecast. Not the best day, not the worst day. We're calling for a pretty cool start out there with temperatures in the upper 40s in parts of the state. As we take a look at uh, northeast and southeast, ignore Groton. I, I can't imagine it's 75 degrees there. There's got to be something wrong with that temperature sensor. Uh, 52 in Salisbury, 48 in Torrington, 47 in Willimantic, 49 in Putnam. Very, very cool out there. The typical overnight low is about 54, so we're even below that at Bradley with a temperature of 50, 53 at Brainerd. The dew points are fairly comfortable. They'll be a little bit more on the rise today than they were yesterday, so it'll be a little bit more humid than it was yesterday, but all in all, not too bad, and the winds are fairly calm with the exception of that southeasterly flow, 12 miles an hour. That might have some influence on that temperature down there in Groton, but I don't think 75 degrees. That's a little wonky. All right, as we take a look at the day ahead, 72, 73, possibly even 74 degrees, you'll notice the mostly cloudy icons. We can't rule out the possibility of an interval of sun 9 10 o'clock this morning so if you see a little bit of sunshine it's just a bonus during the day today but for the most part we do stay dry you'll notice the icons there mostly cloudy right across the board with the temperatures approaching the low 70s for the shoreline as well look at this beautiful start right new london Wow, what a spectacular start that is. No fog to greet us this morning. And we've got some pretty dark conditions in Waterbury where we are under partly to mostly cloudy skies. And we'll take you right now to our Middletown ICAM where we've got partly cloudy skies. So it all depends on where you are this morning. Regional radar dry, that's the way it's gonna stay for most of today. You'll see some showers back to the north and west. This is all the result of a frontal boundary that'll be pushing in tonight through early tomorrow morning. And that's gonna to touch off some scattered showers out there. So. Just just be careful uh, late tonight through early tomorrow morning. We are expecting some downpours in the state and maybe even some lightning and thunder overnight tonight through very early tomorrow. There's Umberto. It is tropical, uh, tropical storm Umberto. It is uh, making a mess of things down in the southern Caribbean, but uh, eventually it will track away from the United States. Let's watch the northern Bahamas. Freeport here. Ugh, gets a little too close for comfort. That's the last thing they need is another storm system. Not a Dorian by any means, but it will turn into a category one and scoot far away from New England, which is great news. All right, here's Futurecast. Tomorrow's weather today. We're backing it up locally. Again, a passing shower is possible. This is 5 p.m. tonight. Maybe a passing shower. We can't rule that out. And then tonight around midnight, that's when we let it all hang out. This is 2 a.m. in the morning. Some lightning, some thunder very early tomorrow morning. And then that's gone by 5.30 tomorrow morning when we're on the air again. The sky should be partly to mostly clear, and tomorrow looks like an amazing day of weather. Here's the wider perspective. We uh, are going to show you that coming up in just a bit. In the meantime, today, daytime highs climb into the low 70s. It's going to be a mostly cloudy day with just a chance for a passing shower on and off throughout the day today. Grab the umbrella, throw it in the back seat of your car. Rather to have it, rather to be safe than sorry. And then your seven-day forecast includes a real nice day tomorrow. Beach day, 80 degrees. Go to the beach. 76 degrees on Monday. Uh, it'll be trending a little bit cooler with showers and thunderstorms developing in the afternoon and evening. That will lower the heat for Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. And then Friday, it starts to get a little bit warmer around here with a temperature of 80 degrees, but you'll notice how beautiful the weather's gonna be Tuesday, Wednesday, yeah. Thursday, and Friday with nice high pressure stretch. and control. So a real nice stretch of weather. Perfect for the Big E and any fairs that are gonna be coming up this upcoming weekend. So keep your fingers crossed that that continues into Saturday and Sunday.